I'm going to be showing you the quickest and easiest way to delegate your towel to a validator so you can start earning towel staking rewards. Now I want to stress that staking towel is at your own risk and you should only do so if you feel comfortable. If you don't feel comfortable even after watching this tutorial, then maybe hold off and do so when you do feel comfortable. So to begin with, we're going to head over to towelstats.io. Towelstats is one of the most respectable projects in the space at the moment, and they have this fantastic website that has all the data about the network and price and everything. So we're going to head over to stake towel. And what we're going to do is we're going to connect our wallet. So I did a tutorial in the previous staking video I did talking about how to create a wallet on the polkadot.js and I'm going to show you that now. I'm just gonna put the old video up. So give that a watch right here, and then we'll get going after that. So the first thing we're gonna need is to create a wallet on the polkadot.js extension via either Chrome, Firefox, or Brave. We're gonna to go to download the extension for Chrome. We're gonna to go to add to Chrome, add the extension. We're going to pin it, just so ease of use. So then look at all the information. Once you've understood it, Click continue. So we're gonna click the big plus icon here. This is gonna add the account to the polkadot.js extension. And here we have the wallet. This is your wallet address. You can copy it here. And here we have the 12 word seed phrase. This is very important. You need to write this down and keep it safe. If you don't have this uh, written down and kept safe, then you may not be able to access your account or wallet in the future. So make sure you write this down, make sure it's safe. Once you have done that, click I have saved my seed safely, and then go to the next step. We wanna name our account. I'm just gonna call this buy towel. Once you're happy with your password and you've repeated it for verification, click next. And there we go. We've created a wallet now that we can house our towel. Now that the wallet's been created, head over to the exchange that towel is on. At the moment, it is MEXC, buy your towel, and then you wanna send it to this wallet address so then the towel shows up in your wallet. We're going to connect this wallet to the towel stats staking section. So we're gonna connect wallet via this button. And then once we're here, we're gonna make sure that we got the right wallet. And then you've got to choose how much towel you want to delegate to the validator. So whether that's all of it, you can do it that so, or choose the amount you want to delegate. Then we have to choose the validator we wanna uh, delegate our towel to. Tau stats have their own validator section, verified validators. You can go through the list here, choose which one you want to delegate your towel to. You can have all the information. I'm personally going to select Roundtable 21. They're a global advisory network. They're doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes to try and help and guide the project in the right direction, consulting with the team themselves. And uh, they're building a lot of cool shit, some stuff that's going to be coming out soon. So I have personally have uh, a good portion of my towel delegated to Roundtable 21, it's something that I trust. So we're going to select Roundtable 21 and then select the amount. We're gonna go with all of it, and then we're gonna delegate. Put in your password, then you just need to wait for the transaction to finish. And there you go, we just delegated 10.411 tau to the Roundtable 21 validator. Now, if we wanna undelegate, we just select the Roundtable 21 validator here, put in the amount, we're gonna select max again, and then we're gonna undelegate. Same process, put in the password. Again, wait for the transaction to finish. And there you go. You just undelegated your towel. And now you can choose another validator if you want to. You can even split the amount of towel. So you could say, I want to put five to round table 21, delegate. And then you could say the other uh, five, I want to delegate to Open Tensor Foundation. You can do so then. And then your validators will be listed here. And it really is that easy. That is the quickest and easiest way to delegate your towel and to start earning staking rewards.